morning guys. We're back here again at the Mysterious Terry shop. Hands all healed up, or at least for the most part. A couple bits of metal still stuck in there, but they'll work their way out eventually. Today we're gonna try and finish up the top fuller that we were working on before, see if we can make something out of that monstrosity. As well, we're gonna give it a crack at making some little tiny plane hammers out of some one inch round 1045. Let's have some fun. So last time one of the biggest problems we had was actually holding on to material. I have what, about a dozen sets of tongs, still couldn't find one to fit it right. So this time, purpose modifying a set of tongs to make it fit, I'm going to take a crappy player of flat jaw tongs, I'm going to weld on, two bits of mild steel to them, stick them in the forge, forge it round, make it work. As always, I have no idea what I'm doing. Here's what we did. We went and we just welded two pieces of flat bar on some flat tongs. We're going to throw them into the forge, heat them up, shake them to our workpiece, and hopefully they'll actually hold on to it. Some point in the future, the mysterious Terry and I are going to take like a day and just make tongs. But uh, that day is not today, so into the forge. love it when they punch out clean like that. <laughs> it's not very often it actually works, but that worked really well. Prick somebody with a pin.
grinders short a few ponies to really be able to do this effectively. So it's the end of the day. We had a very nice successful day. We made four of these little plane hammers. Just in case any of you don't know, plane hammers are used for adjusting the blades in wooden planes. Because they hit steel on steel, you don't harden them, so I'm just going to take them home, grind them up, and get them ready for handles. Thanks again to Alex Steele for showing me how to make these uh, awesome hammers. Uh, link to his channel in the description and to his store. Uh, check him out, he puts out great content and is just a really cool guy. Uh, once again, thanks for watching, I'll have another video out soon.